Ladies and gentlemen, you will please recite the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all.
have any change. It is again that you have allowed a group of citizens to come together. We thank you tonight for men, women, in uniform, who you have given the bravery to wear the badge and to protect the citizens of this country. And as we stand tonight and call upon your name, we are at the changing of the guard. And we ask that you would remember the newly appointed sheriff. Remember the officers that are under him and all of the one that will protect and serve this county. Bless the citizens also. Give them your protection and your power. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Again, good evening. Good evening. It's my pleasure to be here tonight. I know most of you know uh, Flea Atkinson and his many accomplishments, so, but I would like to highlight just a few. First of all, he's married to Kimberly Atkinson, and they have a son, Justin. Trooper Atkinson, soon to be sheriff, is a graduate of White High School in Wilson and Lenore Ryan College. In high school, his accomplishments were many. Some of the highlights are that he was his senior class president. He lettered in football, basketball, and track. He carried his football skills to Lenore Ryan College, where he was a four-year letterman on their football team. He graduated in 1995. In 1997, he began his service as a trooper for the North Carolina Highway Patrol in Edgecombe County, where I had an opportunity to work with him for many years and observe his professionalism and demeanor and character and uh, observe none higher. He served in that position until 2013. At that time, he was assigned to the executive security where he has served until present. He's currently a master trooper with the North Carolina Highway Patrol. In the community, he's used his skills as a coach and he served as a high school football official. I saw him out on football field when my son was playing one day and didn't realize he did that. But he sure does. He's an active member of Thorne's Chapel Missionary Baptist Church. The list of his accomplishments go on and on. Clearly, our county is a fortunate to have him as our next sheriff. And now, at this time, I would like to administer the oath of the office to play Atkinson and if you can step forward uh, with the Bible and the wife and the son and have them hold that and Swear that I will support and maintain that I will support and maintain the Constitution and laws of the United States, the Constitution and laws of the United States, and the Constitution and laws of North Carolina, and the Constitution and laws of North Carolina, not inconsistent therewith, not inconsistent therewith, and that I will faithfully discharge, and that I will faithfully discharge. The duties of my office as Sheriff of Edgecombe County. The duties of my office as Sheriff of Edgecombe County. So help me God. So help me God. I, Cleveland Atkinson, Jr. I, Cleveland Atkinson, Jr. Do solemnly and sincerely swear. Do solemnly and sincerely swear. That I will support the Constitution of the United States. That I will support the Constitution of the United States. That I will be faithful and bear true allegiance. That I will be faithful and bear true allegiance to the state of North Carolina, to the state of North Carolina, and to the constitutional powers and authority, and to the constitutional powers and authorities 
which are or may be established, which are and may be established for the government thereof. For the government thereof. And that I will endeavor to and that I will endeavor to support, <coughs> maintain, and defend. Support, maintain, and defend the Constitution of said state. The Constitution of said state. Not inconsistent with the Constitution of the United States. Repeat that dude. Not inconsistent with the Constitution of the United States. Not inconsistent with the Constitution of the United States. To the best of my knowledge and ability. To the best of my knowledge and ability. So help me God. So help me God. I, Cleveland Atkinson Jr. I, Cleveland Atkinson Jr. Do solemnly swear. Do solemnly swear. That I will execute the office of the Sheriff of Edgecombe County. That I will execute the office of the Sheriff of Edgecombe County. To the best of my knowledge and ability. To the best of my knowledge and ability. Agreeably to law. Agreeably to law. And that I will not take. And that I will not take. Except or receive. Except or receive. Directly or indirectly. Directly and indirectly. Any fee. Any fee. Gift, bribe, or gratuity. Gift, bribe, or gratuity. Or reward whatsoever. Or reward whatsoever. For returning any man to serve as the juror. For returning any man to serve as a juror. Or for making any false return on any process to meet the rest. Repeat that again. <laughs> <laughs> or for making any false return on any process to meet the rest. Or making any false return or be the process or direct. To me direct. To me direct. So help me God. So help me God. Congratulations. And already nervous. <laughs>
sworn personnel. Um, the de deputies sure to stand, please. And if you do not object in placing your left hand on the Bible and raising your right hand, and if you do not want to swear on the Bible, if you just raise your right hand and not place your left hand on the Bible. Each of you to solemnly swear or affirm that you will support and maintain the Constitution and laws of the United States and the Constitution and laws of North Carolina, not inconsistent therewith, and that you will faithfully discharge the duties of your office as deputy sheriff, so help you God. You each solemnly and sincerely swear or affirm that you will support the Constitution of the United States, that you will be faithful and bear true allegiance to the state of North Carolina and to the constitutional powers and authorities which are or may be established for the government thereof, and that you will endeavor to support, maintain, and defend the Constitution of the said state, not inconsistent with the Constitution of the United States, to the best of your knowledge and ability, so help you God. Each of you do solemnly swear or affirm that you will be alert and vigilant to enforce the criminal laws of this state, that you will not be influenced in any matter on account of personal bias or prejudice, that you will faithfully and impartially execute the duties of your office as a law enforcement officer according to the best of your skill, abilities, and judgment. So help you God. Congratulations. and a privilege to, um, for you to be sworn tonight over office of Edgecombe County Detention Officer. If you do not object in placing your left hand on the Bible and raising your right hand, if so or if not, if you raise your right hand to affirm. Each of you, as a detention officer of the Edgecombe County Sheriff's Office, you solemnly swear or affirm that you will support the Constitution and laws of the United States and the Constitution and laws of North Carolina, not inconsistent therewith, and that you will be faithful and bear true allegiance to the state of North Carolina and to the constitutional powers and authorities which are and may be established by the government thereof, 
that you will faithfully follow the rules and regulations of the Edgecombe County Sheriff's Office, that you will conduct yourself in a professional manner in both your personal and professional life, that you will not be influenced in any matter on account of personal bias or prejudice, that you will faithfully discharge the duties of your employment as a detention officer according to the best of your abilities, skill, and judgment, so help you God. Congratulations. that you will support the Constitution and laws of the state of the United States and the Constitution and laws of North Carolina and to, excuse me, and there will, not even system, there will, and that you will faithfully and bear true allegiance to the state of North Carolina and to the constitutional powers and authority which are or may be established for the government thereof, that you will faithfully follow the rules and regulations of Edgecombe County Sheriff's Office, and you will conduct yourself in a professional manner, both personal and professional life, and that you will not be influenced in any manner on account of personal bias or <coughs> prejudice, and that you will faithfully discharge the duties of your employment 
as telecommunicators according to the best of your abilities, skills, and judgment. So help you God. Raise your right hand, please. Put your left hand on the bottom. If you do not swear, just raise your right hand. Please, of the Edgehill County Sheriff's Office, do solemnly swear or affirm that you will support the Constitution and the laws of the state of, of the United States and the Constitution and laws of North Carolina not inconsistent therewith, and that you do promise faithfully to bear true allegiance to the state of North Carolina, and to the constitutional powers and authority which are or may be established for the government thereof, that you faithfully promise to follow the rules and regulations of the Edgecombe County Sheriff's Office. Excuse me and that you conduct yourself in a professional manner in both the personal and professional lives, and that you will not be influenced in any manner on account of personal biases or prejudices, and that you will faithfully discharge the duties of your employment according to the best of your abilities, skill, and judgment. So help you God. Blessed is the man. Yeah. It's an honor to be here today. <coughs> Chief, uh, I saw a couple of Sheriff, Sheriff Stone, hey, um, Sheriff Smith. Uh, these guys are some of the guys that they groomed me. 
first saw the Cobb, the Colonel at the first saw the Colonel Taylor. I got a Colonel of the North Carolina Patrol here, one of the major North Carolina captains, first sergeants. And if somebody I missed, please forgive me. My, my, my sergeants in the back, the sergeants over here, appreciate you guys. Um, been to battle with these guys, retired, been to battle with these guys, so it's, it's, it's an honor. Uh, you guys don't know how hard it was to uh, drop something else and pick it back up. Uh, but God has directed my path. Don't think I'm crazy. Don't think I'm silly. Uh, I really believe God got has something bigger for me. Um, so, so I take that as an honor. I'm thankful uh, to my family. I doubt it here. My family, if you guys are staying once again, um, that's in the building. I appreciate it. Uh, my Howard Patrol family is still going to be my family because I'm going to call on you a lot. My Howard Patrol family, please stand up and I'll miss the few. Please stand. John Manley, the stage of my ear. First order of Washington, stand up so I can still stand before. This is my first order also. Chief John Manley, I uh, thank you so much. Uh, Sheriff Stone has been there with me. Stand up, Sheriff. I didn't I see uh, Sheriff Smith in the back. Thank you so much. Uh, you guys are here grooming, and I appreciate it. My Thorns Chapel Missionary Baptist Church family, if you're staying, I appreciate it. Man, you guys support me so much, and I greatly appreciate it. Um, my friends, uh, thank you guys so much. Uh, the, the, you know, uh, my wife, stand up, and I, and I say she don't like to stand, but she gonna stay today. <laughs> my brothers in the back, I miss you guys. My brother, one of my oldest brothers, he was standing in the rain and watched. I share the story out of time. I get emotional about it. My oldest brother was standing in the rain and watched me play football. Um, I was eight or nine, and I appreciate it. I never forget it. That's why I mentor the way that I do, because he's, he's poured into me, and I appreciate it. I get emotional about that. Um, my wife battled a situation that she called it. And so when I saw the situation that she battled, nothing's too big for me. Nothing's too big for me to challenge. So she's the strongest person in my life. I want to apologize to my son and stand up. Yeah. I want to thank my son because I pour so much into other people's children. You guys don't know how big that is. And I neglect it sometimes. All right. Children. He was awake. So in front of everybody, I want to ask him to forgive me. Amen. Uh, so that I can do better. Father, you that came. Enough to spend time with me, it didn't go in vain. I pushed to the end, I pushed for greatness. When I look at you guys in uniform, each and every day I get up in uniform, I serve the people of that stone down and I did it well. So I take pride in you. I'll be calling on some of you guys to still help me out because I'm gonna need you. The veteran guys that don't on this sheriff's department uniform, I watch you guys and I appreciate you guys. Hey, Major, how you doing? We'll see you Sheriff Stone, thank you. Sheriff <coughs> Stone uh, and Nash County Sheriff Chief Medina, appreciate you, Greg. Thank you, guys. These guys are covering Edgecombe County right now as we speak, so I appreciate you guys so much. Father <laughs> Pete, appreciate you guys. I watched you guys grow up now. You guys have been mentors to me, too, also, and I appreciate it. Major, I appreciate you, too. Sheriff Woods will be here helping me out in the morning. This is called partnership, if you guys hadn't realized it yet. It's called partnership. So I thank you. I get emotional when I think about all the people that's poured into me. So now I gotta pour into all these people. Good to see you, God and wife. Good to see you. Good to see you. I pour into so many other people. I've been raised right. 
I've been groomed in law enforcement the right way. Bear with me, be patient. Uh, it's only yet to be great here in Edgecombe County. I say this to all the men and women, I'm gonna say it again in a few minutes. If they elevate themselves, then they elevate me and we elevate Edgecombe County. It's not about me, it's about them. I was gonna shine a little light this past week. Uh, uh, Miss Bullock and Reverend Walker. And one thing, and I'm gonna leave you guys with this. And some lady called in, and it may be my slogan from here on out. And she said that man, you can be certified by man, but I'm qualified by God. And I take yeah. it Mr. Evans, where's Mr. Evans at before we leave? I missed him when I was talking about well, Raise your hand. I'm ducking. <laughs> Real quick before you leave, he was always one of my dads. I don't even look at him like a district attorney. I still call him judge because he would not only get on the, the civilians, he would get on law enforcement. So I appreciate him. Sorry, judge. I, I was talking to him beforehand. Thank you so much. Thank you guys. Love you guys so much. Okay, thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, sit down. Good. Hold on. Hold on. Well, I appreciate your remark, and I'll just say this. That, um, I think everybody knows what a sacrifice it is to be a law officer. And to be uh, the type of and caliber of officer you are, you did have a good upbringing. And um, I'm excited about you being our new chair. Yes, sir. And we, we know behind every good man is a good woman. Yes, sir. Amen. 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 so much, but this is my daddy, he don't say much, so just, he might pass out of here, so. <laughs> this is my stepmom, and this is my mom. I apologize, it was so much, love you guys, thank you, okay? <laughs> thank you, <sir. laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Good to see you, man. All right, all right, good to see you, all right. You remember that night we was down there? Yes, sir. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Look, I was going to Hey, grab it, guys. Oh yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, I'm not. Yeah. 